guys, it's Cookie and welcome back to another video. Today we're going to be doing part 2 of my series reacting to your Beanie Boo customs where you guys send in your Beanie Boo customs and I react to them. You guys really seemed to like the first part so I knew I had to do a part 2 as soon as possible. And if you guys want to join in in this series, I will give a full overview of how to do that and how to submit your customs at the end of this video. And again, don't worry if your custom hasn't been put in a part yet, it definitely will be and if you submitted multiple, it'll just be put in a different part. So without any further ado, let's get straight into the first custom. So here is the first custom. It was submitted by Beanie Boo Benson on Instagram. It is so adorable. It is made with a yips base and I really love the pastel purple in the ears. I love the different colored spots and the blue patches. I think this is such a cute design. It kind of reminds me of like those cakes that have the sprinkles in them. It just looks like such a sweet custom and I really like it. The next custom was submitted by Gomp That Candy on YouTube. This custom is seriously so unique. I love it so much. I've never seen anybody do eyes like that on a Beanie Boo before. They look super cool. I love the fluff on the side of the face that has been colored rainbow. I think that is such a cool detail to use. And they've put safety pins everywhere. It looks so cool. All the accessories used on this Beanie Boo are just amazing and they fit so well. I really love this custom. This next custom was submitted by Beanie Boo Transformers. It's a phoenix base and its name is Kiwi. And Beanie Boo Transformers said that it's not real just yet, so I'm pretty sure they're going to be making this into a real design. So if they do end up making it and let me know, then I'll definitely put it in a future part when it's done. They've basically turned phoenix into a kiwi i really love this idea i think it is so adorable it would be so cool if you just made like a bunch of fruit beanie brews like how cool would that be and i think a kiwi is a really unique fruit and it's not really known by a lot of people i feel like people don't really like talk about kiwis that much i think this is just a really cool idea and i'm super excited to see the final result if you do end up making her this next custom was submitted by Valaxy on YouTube and its name is Sherry or Cherry. I'm not really sure. I'm sorry if I pronounced that wrong. And it is a muffin base. They've changed the ears and added a ribbon and even though it's like a small-ish change, it still looks so different. Like you can change one thing about a Beanie Boo and it looks completely different. This Beanie Boo is super cute. I think it looks so sweet. And it's just really adorable. This next custom was submitted by Lulu Beanie Boo and it is a honeycomb base. They have completely colored in all of the tan spots black and colored the inner ears a darker purple. I love this Beanie Boo so much. It looks so good. I love the contrast between the black and the blue eyes and the purple is really vibrant and stands out a lot. And the white bits of this Beanie Boo just look so much like glowier, like they look so good. I have no idea how you kept it so clean, it's just amazing. I just really like this Beanie Boo, they look so fluffy and so cute. The next custom was submitted by It's Cookie Boos and its name is Shadow. It is a unicorn. I'm honestly not too sure what base they used. They've almost colored it fully in black. With the exception of some pink and purple in the face, they split dyed the eyes, one is pink and one is purple. Same with the feet, I think this is such a cool detail, I really like it. The eyes especially are one of my favorite bits about this custom, I think that the pink and purple eye look so good. It's a super spooky Halloween unicorn and I really love it. This next custom was done by Beanie Boo Magic and its name is Violet. I am obsessed with this design. I think this is so cool. And I just think the purple details go so well with the silver horn. I love the little eyebrows and eyelining you gave her. Everything just complements each other really well and I'm really obsessed with the accessories you used. 
And the last custom I will be showing you in this video is a little bit scary, so just a little bit of a warning. I will pop a timestamp right now on the screen to show where to skip if you want to skip this beanie brew. So I'll give you three seconds to skip. One, two, three. All right, let's get into the custom. This custom was submitted by Draco Cat Dreams on YouTube. It is called the Creature of Phobias. Guys, this beanie brew is so cool. It is so unique and so detailed. And try and take a guess of what beanie brew this custom was made out of. You won't be able to guess. It was Lala the Lamb. Can you believe it? This beanie brew has the craziest face. It has a mouth open with a bunch of teeth, button eyes everywhere. Like, how spooky is that? I'm obsessed with the wings, they are so cool and detailed, and I love the spikes that line the feet. This beanie root is just so cool and spooky, you put so much effort into making this, it just looks really cool. I've never seen such a detailed custom like this, this is just really really amazing. So that is all the customs for today's video, thank you to everyone who submitted a custom, I really appreciate it. And if you want to submit your customs to be in a future part, all you have to do is either DM me on Instagram at cookie.booze and send me a photo of your custom, or you can post it to the community page on your channel here on YouTube and tag me. So that will be all for today's video. Thank you guys so much for watching. Make sure to like and subscribe, and I hope to see you guys next time. Bye!